friends here we are talking about basic steps to write and execute bash shell script let me go with step by step the very first step is we have to get requirement and its required commands let's say requirement is we need to develop a shell script to find java version and docker version so what are the commands for it see this is the command to find java version and this is the command to find docker version so now we have required commands for our requirement the next step is we have to choose shell type see we know that there are different types of shells and we can develop a shell script by using any one of the shell but anyway bash is the advanced shell that's why here in our course we are going with bash shell that means our shell script is with bash shell or simply bash shell scripting so once you select your shell then you have to find the location of it whatever the shell you selected for that if you want to find the location simply run which space your shell name anyway in our course our shell is bash so i am taking which bash so this is the path after running which bash here we are getting complete path or location of it as slash bin slash bash in some operating systems you may see a location like slash user slash bin slash bash so whatever it may be just note down that path then after that just to open a file using vi or vm editors on your favorite linux or unix or mac os operating system so here mine is sent os so i am taking vi editor or else you can also take vim then some file name so i am taking file name as first script dot sh be clear that extension dot sh is not mandatory just to know that that is a shell script we are using dot sh instead of that you can also take bash dot sh also no problem because we are developing shell script with bash so bash sh but anyway finally it is a shell script that's why generally we follow dot sh but be clear that is not mandatory then open it so once you open your file the very first step you have to write as shebang line shebang line is nothing but the complete path of your shell but before your path of your shell you have to mention has exclamatory symbol that is nothing but shebang line so be clear shebang line is nothing but which type of shell you are using to execute your shell script so now just to go to insert mode of your vi just by pressing i on your keyboard then write hash exclamatory then the complete path of your shell in my case it is slash bin slash bash so this is the very first line you have to write in your shell scripts so after that just place one by one i mean uh, your commands in sequence so our commands are like one is for java version and second one is for docker version that's it save it just press escape then colon w q that's it then after that you have to provide the execution permissions for your script see if i run ls space hyphen lrt there are no execution permissions for your script so you have to provide using change mode command so for user i am giving execution permissions now see that now there is a execution permission now you can run the script like this dot slash your script name dot slash our script name is first script dot sh yes you are getting some output there is one more way that is simply you can provide complete path for your script see as of now my script is there under home vr tech so so i can run like this also home vr tech then your script name complete path that's it 